guys welcome back to another episode of medieval dynasty so today what we're going to be working on is uh there's that uh herb um herbalist uh shack up on the hill there that we still need to finish uh there is also some stuff that we need to sell and uh summer's just around the corner so we'll probably be having that in the next probably today no doubt so we'll have probably some farming and stuff to do as well so um it's pretty packed episode so we'll see if we can't get some of this stuff done right now i i need to sell some stuff i have it in my inventory so we can head over to the town and tend to that and oh and there's that house on the hill as well that we need to uh build um I'm still, we're going to need somebody that's in the extraction to do that. She's in extraction, but it's only a level two extraction, not a level three. I tried to get everyone on level three for their highest skill. Uh, okay, so she's in, I think we spent all our, or got all the How money is life from treating her, you? Only the best products here. Oh no, we still have some money here. Uh, we can sell some buckets then. We can sell 20 buckets. Two soup. And I think that's all she can really afford to purchase. Yeah. Have right. a good day. Alright, so if we have any feathers, we'll be able to buy it, but I doubt we'll, uh, need to. Alright, so farmer's next on the agenda. How is life treating you? My wares never disappoint. So we'll sell the shoes. Then he's down to 189. I think we're gonna probably drain this town as if it's money this season. Okay, so two of these. Uh, now, I did tell her um, cook to stop cooking these because I noticed that the prices vary depending on the bowl quality. So... Um, we're going to start making those ourselves from Goodbye. this point on. Alright, and then there is... I'm just trying to remember all the merchants. Where is the cook? I can't remember where the cook is. She... Oh, I think she's in here. No, that's the farmer. Um... Oh, there she is. How can I help you? Whatever Very mean you need, tone. <laughs> I've got it. Okay, we'll sell you that. Uh, she's got a lot of money, so we'll be able to sell pretty much all this, I think.
All right, guys, so I got uh, quite a bit of the stuff done. I got the walls set up and I got, uh, well, most of the walls. Uh, we still have um, the side walls to do. And then we have one of these walls and then we have some straw that we need to get. I think we need possibly 16 no 32 32 uh straw so we'll have to harvest some of that and um for the roof on this one we're gonna go with that roof style like we have been doing it's a little bit cheaper but doesn't offer as much uh insulation as far as i understand so and then we need planks for that so how many planks 6, 12, 24 planks, and 4 logs, and then there's 4, 8, yeah, we have quite a bit of wood that we need to chop down, actually. Uh, let's go over to that forest over there, and, um, actually, I'm just wondering what's closer. I think those trees might be, well, they might be about the same distance. We'll chop these ones down regardless, and then we can start working back over towards the, um, over down on that hillside. Now these provide three logs each, so it's not exactly enough to do a wall, but um, a few of them will be. If we get four, then we can do like three walls, give or take. And we're running low on thirst, so we're gonna wanna get something to drink pretty soon, which means we have to go down to the river. Oh, it's turning night soon, so we should probably call it a day for uh, working up here. And then we'll have the season change and farming to do. And then we can hopefully get that house done. And then we can find somebody next season to um, work at the herb, uh, herb building. Which should be just in time to get berries without needing to do the forging ourselves. So hopefully if we timed everything perfectly we'll be able to have all that set up. Uh, I am going to just drop this wood off over here and then I'm going to go down because we're pretty much out of <laughs> water now. Um, I'm just going to throw it all in the, um, the building here and then we'll tend to it next uh, season. So drop that.
All right, so I got the farming all done. Uh, we have all that cabbage planted now, and uh, we're doing the same thing that we did last year uh, when it comes down to um, basically sowing. So we got the, uh, what was it? The, the place where we grew our flax, we basically are growing cabbage now, so uh, it will um, benefit us a l with a huge boost for um, production, or at least cabbage for the winter and autumn and winter. Um, we also get a boost of crops during the autumn for carrots and beets, so that will um, be a good start and stuff. So I got, uh, I brought some extra logs up from the the storage shed just so we could build that and this so yeah I figured it would pro oh it might not be even 64 yeah it looks like it's just like um, 16 actually alrighty then good to know Okay, so that should be set up now and uh, what we can do here is we can once we get somebody in here we'll be able to um, get them to collect berries and stuff for us so let's go and check a couple of the towns see if we can't find somebody that works in um, oh what was it the extraction because that would be extraction building so We'll see if we can't go into town, one of the towns, and get somebody. If not, then we do have the person that was working at the well. We can keep up with that uh, until we can find somebody. And we can just get them to go up the hill and do their work shift. But um, let's see if we can't find somebody to put in that house first. And if we can't find anyone here, then we'll go across the way and try try that settlement and then if that's not the case and we'll go a little bit further back but got three people here uh, none of which are good in extraction so we'll go across the way and then we'll take a look running low on energy <laughs> That's why the uh, heavy breathing and stuff.
Alright guys, we got a lot of stuff done today. I'm pretty impressed with uh, getting the herbalist um, building all set up. We could use a couple paths just going to it though. So we'll see if we can't do that quickly. And um, down here, I was thinking about putting um, something else. It's pretty flat, so we could probably put something in here. Uh, I'm not sure what we could use. That's the only thing that I'm not too sure about. Um, it's a good chunk of plot, though, so... Maybe we can do farming or something like that. We have another spot for the um, person, but farming's mostly over there. But I'm not sure if I want to put farming actually there because there's like a good chunk of flat space up here a little bit. And we still have to think about uh, mining and stuff like that too, right? So there's all this land that's basically pretty flat. And I think. If I remember correctly, if we keep going this direction, uh, there is a cave right in there, but there's also a grizzly bear, so or a bear of some sort. But um, there's plenty of places to build and stuff along the way. Um, there's a pretty good chunk of flat area around here. Uh, the one thing that we did build on, and the reason why I built there, was because there's a patch of soil that, if I remember correctly from my personal save, it was a while ago since I played it, like we're talking months, uh, this game, but um, I'm pretty sure this is a bandit camp right there, so in that little area right here. Uh, it's been flattened out, um, you can kind of see how it's pretty flat and stuff like that and I'm pretty sure bandits would spawn here mm -hmm. hence the fence hence the structures so they won't s spawn here anymore but um, yeah I'm, I, I remember coming up here and then there was camp somewhere around here and I had to go up on a mountain range and it feels right about in this area where I battled them so I'm pretty sure this is going to be one of those major bandit camps. Anyhow, um, it doesn't matter too much. Uh, we got uh, structures here so they won't spawn. If you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.